You look amazing, as always. Thank you. Yeah, you look gorgeous. Thanks for being here. Of course. Now, this is nice of you to be here because what they don't know is that you are in the middle of a cross-country road trip, and you stopped your road trip to fly in and be with us right now, and then you're going to fly back and rejoin the road trip? Yeah, it kind of doesn't make sense because I'm not, no, I'm not on the road. I'm, I flew here, but right. I drove. I started in Atlanta. And I am going to end up back in L.A., but in the middle of the trip, I, you invited me to come hang out with you. So yeah. I flew here, and I'm, I'm flying back later this afternoon. You have no watch there. I was... <laughs> no. <laughs> According to my wrist bone, I need to be back. Um... But, yeah, no, I, I have uh, three, uh, five friends, uh, two cars, and a cat waiting for me in Texas. And I'm going to fly back later tonight, and we're going to keep going. Okay, here's the thing about a road trip. How do you like the people you're driving with? Because you need... To really like the people you're in a car with when you're driving across the country. Fact. You yeah. Know, I know this. I know this very well because I actually attempted to do this once before and failed because I didn't really like the person very much. So what do you do? To, how, how do you call the trip off? It's you can't. It's it's awkward. You can't. If you're sitting there in the car with the person, you can't say this isn't working out when you're <laughs> right in the middle of the country. Yeah. Uh, no, I just dropped him off on the side of the road and kept. No, I didn't. Um, <laughs> I. Uh, no, I, I, I was kind of, it was clever. It was like, oh, I've never been to Sedona. Let's go to Sedona. And then we, as we were driving through, stopped in Sedona. And I was like, wow, it's so great here. We should stay, huh? Let's just ship the car back. Oh, and that's so nice. So I did. So you just hung out there. And then you could add, go, four days and then then you could the go get back. your own room and just hang out <laughs> by the Coke machine. Yeah. Um, I think that's the right way to go. So you're going to yeah. go back and rejoin this road trip. And while you've been yes. on the road, I'm told that you've been leaving... Yeah. A little, like it's a scavenger hunt kind well, of thing. This for is, fans, is that right? Sort of. But this is the thing. I've never done this before. And, I, and because of the last experience, I really wanted it to be fun. And we don't have a set date that we have to be anywhere. We're taking our time. And we're switching people per car every time we go to a different city so we don't get sick of each other again. Mm -hmm. um, taking a lot of precautions. Yeah, good. this time is very good. planned out. Good. Um, and one of the things is a cross-country scavenger hunt. So we're leaving an item in every single city that we go to, and I'm Instagramming hints for every uh, for people to find them. This is cool. So your fans are actually uh, looking for some of these things that you've left. Where are you leaving this stuff? You're leaving it like if you stop at a bar, if you stop at a restaurant, yeah. side of the road. Yeah, wherever we want. And and uh, this morning, right before I got on the plane to come see you, uh, you were my inspiration, and uh, you were the last hint. Let's take a look at this Instagram uh, picture. Oh, my God. <laughs> you captured my expression perfectly. <laughs> Why am I crying? All right. <laughs> well, you... <laughs> That's so cool. So uh, some, some fan has to try and find that. Yeah, they have to try to find that. And that's the hint, everyone. So okay. there is a Polaroid picture of us, of me spray painting you on a wall in Austin, Texas somewhere. In, it's somewhere in Austin. Yeah. Okay, and the owner of that wall is also looking for you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're in trouble. Um, is it true that you're, this is, this is it for the Vampire Diaries, you, you decided that was enough? Because the show's been so popular, so you just decided, I'm done? It's been six amazing long years, and it's been such a great, beautiful journey, and I mean, I was a baby when I started. Right. But I'm not a real vampire in real life. At some point, I have to go live my human life, and, and I'm looking forward to the next chapter and the next adventures to come. It's, it's an, an exciting... Who knows what's going to happen? And right. That's, that's what's exciting to me, that I don't know what's going to happen. Anything could happen. Is your family, they're supportive of you taking off in a new direction? They are very supportive. Yeah, they're very supportive. You've talked about them before. Your mom sounds like a real character. Yeah, she's cool. She's really cool. She's very, she's, she's very supportive, and she's very... Um, Clearly, she's the artist in the family, not me, based on that picture you guys all saw. Um. I thought that was beautiful. That's the best I've ever... That's the best I've looked in a long time. <laughs> you were... Last time you were... I think it was the last time you were on the show, uh, or one of the recent times you were on the show, you did this amazing yoga move where you bent over backwards <laughs> on your head. Do you remember that? Yeah, where is this going? Well, I was just curious <laughs> if you were backstage and saw my amazing split. That was good, yeah. Did you see my split? Yeah, you, you're, you, you've you been working on the yoga since I was here last year. Yeah. Pretty flexible, yeah. right, guys? That was real flexible. Yeah. <laughs> would you like to do... Uh, would you, I want to see if you... Would you like to do this with me right now? Because you, you're pretty good at it. 
I can do the split, yes. All right. I just want this photograph. That's all I want. I do want a guys, photograph. Should I do Yeah, let's take a look. Let's do this. Let's take one second. I'm going to stay here. I'm going to stay here. Let's take one second. Uh, I'm getting one of these at home, by the way. These are absolutely fantastic. That was pretty impressive. Yeah. Wait, so I want to see the whole... I love that anyone tuning in right now, <laughs> if someone's tuning in right now, <laughs> they're so freaking impressed with me. <laughs> <laughs> you want to try this? All right. Do you I'm need gonna need your assistance again, like yes. last time. Okay. So what do I do? I just hold you here. Just hold my hand. Okay. This is going to be incredible television. <laughs> it's a good thing I wore shorts today. Oh my God. Soul Food, and on July 18th, they'll be appearing at the Forecastle Festival in Louisville, Kentucky. Please welcome Robert Randolph, John Badesky, and the North Mississippi All Stars, also known as The Word. Yeah. 